What's up dudes? Welcome back for another music video reaction. And naturally because this one is Hyuna. Hyuna is from formerly of my number one all time and only ever bias group in K-pop for a minute. I'm excited for this, not to mention I like Hyuna as a soloist as well. I like all the four minute girls as soloists. If they all chose to be soloists, I would 100% enjoy that. So we got we got a new we got a new release and we're gonna check it out. Always interested to see what she comes out with because I mean it, it's new music and that's interesting and also reasons I guess I don't know I don't really have a good reason why I'm always interested but uh, I didn't have one prepared at the very least so I'm gonna do what I do in all my videos and I'm gonna listen to this song and I'm gonna give you guys my honest first impression thoughts and opinions whether I like the song or not so that means if I like if I don't like the song I'm gonna tell you I'm gonna tell you why so if that is something that is interesting to you at any point during the time of this video then you can do you can or you should and I would do encourage you to please click on the subscribe button down below so that you could hear more of what I've got to say in the future so with all that being said, I got the headphones on, so let's get this song started. Oh, you're go you're going with the you're going with the IU thing. You're gonna make a song about your age. Is that how this is? <laughs> Just kidding. So there's, there's a little teeny, a little, a little teeny tiny bit of tropical feel in there. I suppose it fits though, I don't know. We'll see. Okay, so that whole intro verse whatever is com I mean this is the chorus and all that stuff so it's different. Uh I I'm enjoy I'm I'm kind I'm enjoying this, but probably not potentially. I don't know. Maybe for the reason that you would expect, but we'll go. We'll talk. We'll talk about that after this. After the song. After I get the opportunity to digest all of this. So. Like I, I enjoy it. I definitely do. I, I am enjoying this song. It's a really good song. It's not like I would put that up at the top of her song, uh, like one of her best songs ever. I personally, like I'm really enjoying it. But at the same time, it's just kind of like, it's fun. It's a little dancey, you know. You want to like move your body a little bit, but I'm not, I'm not like in absolute love with this song. But I mean, I'm still, I'm still, I'm still digging it. Obviously, I mean, I, I've already, I've already said that. I just said that. Pretty sure I started that whole statement off with saying, "I'm digging this," but whatever. Alright, that's uh, that was a, uh, I don't know, 
I don't know. It's not. It's not. It's not. A, it's not a song that is like quite as like just. It's, it's not like a song that just like wants to reach out and grab you and just like suck you in and be like just pay attention to me, right? Yeah, I'm not. I'm not really feeling that that vibe and that attitude and all that stuff that she's released with her a lot of her previous songs. And this leads me to the reason why I'm actually really like enjoying this and I'm not and, and I don't know maybe because of what this song is and the and the concept and the idea and all that stuff behind it and the feel is like like taking me taking me as, as I'm, a, I'm a little unsure at the moment I like it but I don't know if I love it you know if that makes any sense but to lead into that I gotta ask you I gotta ask you this question this question uh, wh- when was the last time that you had ever considered that Hyuna would show up in a music video in a school uniform? Right. When when was the last time that you would have ever th- ever thought that? Honestly, probably never. When it when it comes to her, her solo music, in all honesty. But when was when was the last song that she released that was not relatively heavily playing on her sex appeal? Right. When was the last song that was? It, was it was it Bubble Pop? Was it potentially Ice Cream? Was it like three three years ago, maybe or two? However long ago those songs were, was it was it like before? Yeah, definitely it was before Four Minute went with like Brave Brothers and all that or Brave Sounds to produce some of the music. It's been a while since she she's gone anything. She's done something that wasn't necessarily, you know, more you know, uh, playing on the sex, on the sex appeal or, you know, being any of that stuff, right? It's been a while since she's, she's gone for something that is much lighter toned, less aggressive attitude, less badass, less just like I'm sexy and I know it. And just like flaunting all that for everyone to see. This is a very much different vibe than a lot of her previous songs. And that's cool. That's definitely interesting. I don't know exactly what kind of would have motivated this because that whole persona that we kind of talked about previously that she's released well you know in like all of her a whatever series of albums basically all of her solo albums since she not not since she left four minute but you know in the last two three years have been very much you know predicated or the have been basist have been based on her you know serious aggressive like Added, like attitude her her just general i suppose confidence in in who she is and her appearance and all of this kind of stuff that's very much what the music and the visual style has been based upon this one is is not and i and i do kind of think that the whole i the whole idea of course of this song gener- just from the little snippets of the song that i understood is more like you know despite the fact that she's whatever age you know you this dude whoever kind of make, potentially makes me feel younger and that i suppose that's represented in, in this music video by the fact that she's not necessarily the 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 woman who has developed her persona her stage persona to be someone who is like sexually attractive and you know like that but instead she is i, I guess or i assume who she was in the past, who's not necessarily as developed in that in that in that regard, which is interesting, and it definitely you do you do definitely get a more innocent and you know friendly and soft vibe from the song and the music video, which, like I said, going back to kind of what I said at the beginning of this video or what I brought up during the music video itself is different than what she's done and what her just brand and persona is seems to be based upon. So. It's it's interesting. I I definitely do enjoy it. I, I mean, I think that this is definitely a song that I'm gonna have to listen to more. And the reason that I say that I have to listen to this more is because probably because of the fact that I was not expecting this. I was expecting another song where she was just gonna throw down and give us a, a song that was like hard hitting that had tons of energy, which is gonna come out and attack from the start. And the fact that this song was not that, I was I'm, I'm like. I'm a little, I'm a little taken aback. I'm a little surprised by it. I don't quite know how to react, and so I will need to listen to this more to just kind of like fully digest it. You know, take, take, take the time to enjoy this song. Enjoy this song for what it is, despite the fact that it wasn't what I was expecting. Not necessarily that I wasn't expecting it means that it's a bad thing, but you know, it definitely is not what I was expecting. So I I definitely do enjoy that aspect of it quite a bit. I don't really have any opinions on the song because I think on I think honestly the song's kind of 
you know, bland, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. You know, the song, not every song has to be super exciting. It doesn't have to have like a million interesting points to it or anything like that. It just needs to be something to convey a feeling, a mood or a message. And I think the song did that pretty effectively. So that's all I got. Uh, I'm, I'm psyched for this new, this new song. I'm psyched for this new album from her. I'm, I'm really, really interested to get into this album and or the, the rest of these songs on that, that are associated with this release and listen to them and compare them to previous releases. Very, 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 very interested in that to see so to see if, if, the, if the entire album itself has changed. So that's all that I got to say for the song and the music video. I want to know what you guys have to say about it. So put your thoughts and comments down below. If you like this song, share what you liked about it. If you didn't like this song, that's perfectly fine too. So share what you like, what you did not like about the song down below. Feel free to share your opinions, no matter what you think of this song, because this community that we are trying to build here is supposed to be open and friendly, or friendly and open for free discussion of whatever it is that we think. You know, just don't be mean or hateful. So. Put your comments down below. Let's get a discussion going. If you want to join that community, then please do consider clicking on the subscribe button down below. So that's going to be it. Before I go, though, I just want to remind you guys that I do have social media. So if you want to get connected with me someplace that is not specifically YouTube, such as Twitter, Facebook, or Instagram, I do have profiles on each of those social media platforms. So if you want to get connected, you just all you got to do is search for me at ROK Music Review on your social media platform of choice. Or you can go down in the description box below and you can click on one of those links and give me a follow. So that is going to be it for this video. As always, I want to thank you for watching and I will see you all next time.